want to give us a cut. That's why Paulie wanted to take the bank. Because he realized how Salieri was ripping us oh, off. He wanted to take he the bank. He told before. me about those diamonds, Tom. He only wanted to keep them secret so nobody knew where they were before he sold them. No, Besides, the diamonds have nothing to do with the fact that you didn't kill Frank. He broke the Omerta. Which is worse, Tom. How do you know I didn't kill Frank? You can blame it all on someone else you didn't kill. You're too human. She came back to the city and we found her by accident. Damn it. Uh -huh. Tom, 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 you know you can't trust the dame. I can understand it isn't easy to kill your wife's best friend. Yeah, I should have done it for you. <laughs> she also pleaded with me and cried. Uh, well, we realized that we couldn't rely on you, so we checked up a little and found out about Frank. Sam, do you really think everything has to end like this? We still got a chance. There Not ain't no sure. way back now, Tom. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yeah, so when I first played this, I didn't know... Yeah. I didn't know uh, how to do this. And I don't really remember. I think, yeah, you just need to shoot him a bunch. Um, yeah. I think that's it. Yeah, yeah there's blood now. Um, yeah, I was just running around um, trying to catch him, but it's impossible. Are you kidding me? You have to shoot him until uh, he bleeds, and then, you know, you get the blood trail. Each other or something. Oh my goodness! This this uh, part is very bad with only twelve health. But I have to do this now because it's it's the end. After this, it's over. Jesus. You kidding me? Come on, run, scram. Basically, it's a, impossible to catch him. He just runs around. You need to do this. And then... Um, yeah, there's blood. Ah! Jeez, come on! It's impossible to shoot him first. The, the first time I shot him first and he still killed me for some reason. Okay. 
shotgun. It's gonna be no, it doesn't matter because he gets the first shot. No shotgun is terrible. I know what I could try to do. What I could do is just run here while shooting. Yeah, Ow. bitch. <clears throat> Tricked you. I think that's it. I think there was no more gameplay. Oh no. Damn it. Hey, it's the same situation again, Tom. And once again, you can't decide. <laughs> Damn it. Thank rabbit. And that uh, door sound sounded like from Hitman. Like a metal door. Oh wow, I think I've been playing for a couple of hours. But it's glad to be over. And the Mafia 2 will be much easier, except for one mission. You, you did it, but you they'll get you all the same. Salieri will get you. He stood by you, you rat. You're dangerous, Tom. And Paulie is dead. He was never, never sure that you would, wouldn't forgive his death. Oh, you're gonna have to hide like an outcast. And one day, they'll get you, all the same, <laughs> like Frank. They found him? You only, like, lengthened his life, but in the end, they found him, all the same. And Frank was the Don's only real friend. Friendship ain't worth shit. Yeah. Oh. So that's the reason why we have been talking to that detective. And telling our story to him. Epilogue. So it was you again, huh? You destroyed the picture collection worth a few million dollars? I wasn't planning on it, but somehow it worked out that way. Otherwise, that's everything? I got out of there fast. It was no picnic. I really was in danger, but I pulled it off. I took the wife and daughter and immediately left the country. Sam was right. If they decided to find Frank in Europe and take revenge almost five years after he disappeared, they wouldn't let me just leave after betraying them. And you're willing to say all that you've now said to me in front of a court? Yep. Give evidence against all those men? Don't you think the situation will be a lot worse for you? What you're planning to do now is a betrayal. It's more like treason. If these people go to jail, or better yet, death row, they won't be able to take revenge on me. 
at least not as easily as if they were free. I am willing to give evidence against them if you ensure our protection and after the trial, a new identity for me, my wife, and my daughter. If we manage to pull it off, it'll be the biggest legal battle this country's ever seen. It's an interesting offer. I don't know if it's moral to help somebody like you, but I think the results will be worth it. I think we'll help you. Cool. Gangster trial. Slayer's gang with the high bombs. Made the gangsters go away too. Electric chair, so where is it? Um... Everything worked out until the legal case. I sat in my cell and wrote down the evidence I had against all the people I had worked with. People I had been friends with for 10 years. The case was huge and caused a shock throughout the country. Friendship ain't worth shit. Salieri got life. Even some of his thugs got the chair. The shorter sentence was eight years. I spent the whole time in a closed cell at a secret location with no visitors. I didn't see Sarah or my little girl the entire time. In the end, it was worth it. Norman got us new identities and moved us to the other end of the US. I got work as a driver for a respectable company. We started a whole new life. This peace was only interrupted by the war, but we got through it. <sighs> my, my. And here comes Wito and Cho. Angelo. Uh, yes? Mr. Salieri sends his regards. You know, the world isn't run by the laws written on paper. It's run by people. Some according to laws, others not. It depends on each individual how his world will be, how he makes it. And you also need a whole lot of luck so that somebody else doesn't make your life hell. And it ain't as simple as they tell you in grade school. But it is good to have strong values and to maintain them in marriage, in crime, in war. Always and everywhere. I messed up. So did Polly and Sam. We wanted a better life, but in the end, we were a lot worse off than most other people. You know, I think it's important to keep a balance in things. Yeah, balance, that's the right word. Because the guy who wants too much risks losing absolutely everything. Of course, the guy who wants too little from life <laughs> might not get anything at all. The end. So being in the cab driver, you're, no, you're not reaching for anything, you're not taking risks. You're getting a little pay, a little risk. A little risk, a little pay. But if you're a mobster, you're taking high risks, getting high rewards. How? That's um, an interesting song. So yeah, that was um, that was pretty cool. Um, so yeah, like I said, I'll be playing Mafia 2 and maybe, just maybe Mafia 3 as well, but I'm not sure when. I, I want to finish Mountain Blade and uh, get further on with uh, Skyrim. Maybe start Fallout again. No, 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 just continue. I've never heard this song before. Mare Frados. Um, so yeah. And uh, what else? Apart from Mafia 2, what else do I want to start playing? I want to start playing the really recent Evil series, uh, Splinter Cell, and Metal Gear Solid. 
can sound now as well, but uh, I don't know about those, like, um, they kind of remind me of Mafia, like, uh, I would, I would put the, those games on the same tier as Mafia, in old school, like, Skyrim is probably the, the most, newest game I played on uh, the channel so I want to have a mix of like uh, new games, modern games and, and uh, old games like uh, I'd say Stalker somewhere in between but uh, yeah I like to play some Far Cry 3 and uh, something else like GTA 5 or something I don't know but yeah those, those are more like on the modern side while uh, like Resident Evil, Mafia and whatnot are old school. Lords of Brooklyn. Let me check, is that, is that a Chuck, Chuck song or... Because it doesn't sound like their accents. They and the sound foreign. Since this was game was made by the Chuck group of the people thing. No, it's actually American. Crossover hip hop and rock. Irish and American. Cool. Mm, videos are rap. Nice. The group briefly collaborated with the rap supergroup La Coca Nostra, another mafioso rap band. House of Pain. Okay. Um. Yeah. Is that the end of credits? And then uh, it turns out I wasn't recording this whole thing. And I have to redo it all over again. Knock on the wood, that's not gonna happen. Free ride, yeah, that's like free roaming. I don't know, it's extreme. But yeah, thank you for watching, and see you guys in the next Let's Play. Bye!